Welcome back to our channel. Today we've got an amazing tutorial for you on how to set up a V2Ray VMS server on Netmod VPN using the UDP custom platform. For more hidden tricks, VPN files, and updates, make sure to visit our blog. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more tutorials and updates. Now let's get started. First, open any web browser on your device. In the search bar, type UDP Custom and hit Enter. You'll see a list of search results. Click on the official UDP Custom website. This is where we'll create our V2Ray Slow DNS server. Once you're on the UDP Custom homepage, locate the menu icon. It may look like three horizontal lines, also known as a hamburger icon. It's usually in the top corner of the page. Click on it to reveal a list of options. From the list of options, click on V2Ray Slow DNS Server. This option allows you to create a V2Ray server that supports slow DNS. When you click, it will take you to the next page, where you'll be asked to select a server location. After selecting the location, you'll be redirect to an account creation page. Enter a username, solve the CAPTCHA to prove you're not a robot, and click Create Now. Within seconds, your server will be created and the server details will be displayed on the screen. Now that we have our V2Ray VMS server, we need to download the Netmod VPN app. Open your Play Store, search for Netmod VPN, and in the search results, find and click on it. Then, click the Install button to download it onto your device. Once the app is installed, click the Open button to reach the app's home screen. On the home screen, click the three dots in the upper right corner to expand the list. First, copy the V2Ray VMS server details from the UDP custom website. Then, click on the option to import from clipboard. In a few seconds, the server will automatically add all the settings. If you have a valid SNI, click the pencil icon to edit the SNI. The SNI page will open, and you'll see a box labeled Server Name Indication. Enter the valid SNI for better speed and once added, click the upper right button to save the settings. Once the SNI is added, click the play button below to connect to the VPN for a fast and secure web connection. And that's it. There you have it. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.